Hello, my name is Amy Ecker. Welcome to my channel. So today I am featuring the Fora Foundation. I was lucky enough to obtain this from Y Commerce. It is a group that works with Glam Girls and Yana had contacted me to try some of the products that they have on their Y Commerce website. So I am looking forward to trying these today. Fora has about 10 colors for light, medium, and dark skin. So just having 10 colors doesn't mean that there are a lot of colors, but you can mix and match and kind of blend either up or down if, it, if they don't have the perfect color for you. Today I'm using the color, I believe it's Buff Beige. It's number 104 Buff Beige, and it is a soft matte finish. This packaging is fantastic. It has a twist top, so you can twist it off or on. So if you travel, you can kind of lock it down, put it in your bag, and you are ready to start your traveling adventures. I also like that it is a plastic bottle versus a glass bottle, so that does help, again, with traveling. Or if you have kids, if the kids come running through, accidentally knock it off your table or your vanity you don't have to worry about it breaking so i do love the packaging again this is in one standard fluid ounce and i am totally excited to see what this does in an all-day wear test i have noticed this out on instagram so instagram had been promoting this brand and we're going to see how this does throughout the day i do know foria has other cosmetics other than foundations i have not tried any of there are other items, so we're going to see. This might be just the toe into the pool and trying some new products. All right, y'all. If you want to see how this all-day wear test holds up, you're in the right spot, so stay Good tuned. Good morning. Y Commerce was kind enough to send me a Fora foundation, so we are going to try that today in an all-day wear test. I have seen that out on YouTube, and so, not YouTube. I'm sorry, it's probably out on YouTube, but Instagram. I've seen a lot of Instagram posts on it. So we are gonna test this baby out today. And we're gonna start out using the Scandinavia Makeup Finishing Spray. It says, always shake before use to activate. Pump foundation onto the back of your hand. Start with one pump for medium coverage and build to full coverage, which is good for me since I have cheetah spots and redness. Pick up the foundation with your brush, starting in the center of your face and working outward. Blend on the skin using short downward strokes. Blend well into the jawline, hairline to assure an even appearance. This is distributed by Fora Cosmetics, made in PRC. It looks like it is about the standard... Yes, it's standard one fluid ounce, and this color is in 104 bush Buff Beige, and it is in a soft matte finish. So it does say to use a brush, and I don't really use brushes per se for my foundation, so we're going to use this little guy, big guy. I guess it's kind of a brush, right? It says to start with one pump. There we go. We actually started with two pumps. I'm going to use a third pump along my neck. And I think it does give a nice medium coverage with a couple pumps. I'm now going to go ahead and switch and use my Makeup Geek blending sponge. And I'm just going to add some more and see how we can build this up. Okay, I think even using the sponge, it bounced into the skin really nice. So I think you can use a brush or a beauty blender. We are gonna go ahead and finish my makeup and go ahead and test this baby out all day. So wish okay, it luck. Okay, so it's the end of a 12 hour workday and yeah, I'm looking like a hot mess. More mess, not a lot of hot. So let's zoom in and see what we got going on. So it's over the top muggy outside. The humidity is off the hook um, and you can kind of tell by my makeup and my allergies. Check that out. Like my wing is taking off. So I have rubbed my face quite a bit today and I have been outside for the last hour 
putting some plants in pots so I've got yeah, it's just humid like off the hook humid Whew. all right so I must have rubbed my nose at some point because man I am missing a total swipe mark and you can see I've got little dirt pieces all over me I need to jump in the shower I guess I got potting soil everywhere um, everywhere on my face did okay I mean you can see where my glasses kind of pushed it so my really oily areas which are kind of right here it's pushed my oils have pushed the product right up off of my face but where I'm typically drier I'm not having that problem I did notice that while I was sweating and I kind of moved my arm like touched my face to my shoulder it did pull off some of the makeup now for me I I have tried this foundation when it was cooler weather and really liked it I like the full coverage piece of it again I've just had a really bad day with allergies and the weather here is like a sauna in fact I talked to some of my other Texas people and they're like oh my gosh can you believe what a sauna it is it's it's a little crazy how do I feel about this foundation I like the foundation overall again I do have some oils kind of pushing it up but with as hot and humid as it was today it did still kind of hold that full coverage foundation it does transfer so be prepared for that and if you've got oily skin like I do just be prepared that it's going to push up so you may want to go ahead and use the blotting powders throughout the day and I think you'll be okay to make it last a little bit longer so yeah that's what I think but I do like this foundation overall even though I really put it to the test outside in the in the elements I did take this foundation to the edge in elements all right y'all I hope this helps you with your buying power thank you so much for watching today uh, the all-day wear test using the Foria foundation it is a coverage foundation naturally flawless oil controlling and lightweight feel it is buildable and I'm glad you got to see that in the video and yeah since I'm filming the exit before the all-day wear test I guess by this time you already know how it performed but I did like how it blended up or built up and so that was really nice for me with all of my skin issues if you do have any thoughts questions comments below please if you do have any please leave those below and again I want to uh, thank the Y Commerce team for sending me this to test I did not pay for this bottle myself I have purchased two other colors on my own so just want to let you know this bottle that I tested today was free all right leave your comments thoughts questions below and um, yeah I'll see you in the next video